I cannot stop moving. I cannot stop grinding. Regardless of FedEx, man. I gotta get my shit together, bro. What's up, what's up, what's up? It's your boy King J and I'm back in the building. Back with another video. Still stuffy. But feeling better. Um, man. It's crazy not working at FedEx no more. I'm telling you, like, that 30 day stride did something to me, bro. But I'm gonna be straight. You know what I'm saying? Like, if anything, this has shown me that I cannot stop moving, I cannot stop grinding. Regardless of FedEx, man, I gotta get my shit together, bro. So, I gotta go to Sam's Club this morning. What else I gotta do? Probably stop at Walmart. I gotta return this pen, cause I ain't returned it yesterday. Um, <clears throat> it's just some shit I gotta do for the house, make sure we stacked up. And then, I might run to the library when I come back. I actually might hit Lowe's. I gotta get some cleaning stuff. Like I gotta get some wood polish. Um, probably another Windex. Start to create my cleaning bag. Get my stuff ready. You know? So, how's everybody doing this morning? I hope y'all having a good morning. I hope y'all warm fucking cold man but it's a good day to be alive i'm thankful to be alive I'm thankful to be here you know uh when i say here i mean in this moment in time you know really just like these past couple weeks well the last couple weeks the last week been kind of tough you want me you know what i'm saying like it's kind of been like a big reflection of I always say this, a big reflection of, like, everything in my life. I feel like, you know, something happens, you know, it's steady, and then, boom, it's just gone. Um, whether it's my doing or, you know, it's, it's just, like, sometimes it feels like things are going so great for a minute. And then before you know, it's, like, back to back to the back to the bullshit, man. So, I'm going to take this sign from the universe as a notion to just push myself forward. And I'm just, I think I'm really just stuck in my head right now about rates, you know what I'm saying? Like the market down here and, and, and the industry is different than the city. So, you know, I was coming out the gate with my little, you know, hourly rate. And my hourly rate is pretty, pretty deep, you know, for the, for the services that I provide. But I feel like I'm going to have to get it together because I'm going to have to draw these people in somehow, you know. I understand they don't want to pay that high rate, you know, especially me looking on Craigslist. People are not really looking, if that's the case, you know, they're not really looking for that luxury and then all that shit. Um, and I'm licensed now, baby. I'm licensed and I'm insured. So that's a whole different level. Whole different level and a whole different, whole different ball game that I'm playing right now. So people gonna have to pay to play, but with that, I don't want to just knock all my opportunities out the window because I'm fixated on getting a certain rate. You know, I think I I, I've, I keep forgetting like I gotta start from the bottom, and you know, starting from the bottom, I gotta build up some type of cred. You know, get some weekly contracts going. I had a customer, I had a client. I got two prospective clients. One client hit me up a couple of days ago via text, and another one just hit me up in the uh, email. And he was basically like, you know, I got a, I got a 1,200 foot square space and I'm looking for bi-weekly cleaning, you know, and I'm I'm just kind of sometimes stuck on that estimate because it's like, I don't want to lowball myself, you know, I've been there, done that, but I feel like starting over, I'm going to have to in a way, you know what I'm saying, to get into the door down here um, and to start fucking working like. I don't want to blow all my leads just because I'm fixated on a certain number, you know, and people are not giving it to me. Like, I understand, you know, like I'm 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 just really kind of stuck in that place of, you know, I don't know. I got to figure it out today. 
figure out some type of plan that makes sense. Um, you know, and again, these are houses, man. So it's like that little three, four hours I'm spending in apartments, man. I might be like five, six, seven hours in these houses, and it sucks, but it is what it is, man. And I got to just account for that time, yo. You know, um, my time is everything right now. And so if I'm only able to do a job a day, you know what I'm saying? And plus I'm like a pri I'm pri I'm like I'm private. So this is not like I'm under some type of business or a contractor or something for another company like nah man, like, this is my shit. But like I said, you know, the same way they got to pay to play, man. I got to, you know, get into it, you know, get these leads going. Secure these leads because the lead is great, but if I don't secure it, then you know I just let it escape. I mean, some of them is okay, but others, you know, I, I just gotta. I see like a lot of them, it's not really crazy, crazy cleaning. So that's a great thing, you know, versus others where I might have to scale up in my prices this, that, and the third for that certain job or project. It's just a lot going on. It's it's everything coming to a head right now. I just got to jump on the, on, on the ship and just start sailing, you know. Um, and so that's part of being <laughs> uncomfortable again because, you know, you just got to pull the trigger, man. I can't keep waiting around, you know. So I'm going to go ahead and run these errands right now. And, um, yeah, maybe I'll show you all what I got. I'm go to Sam's Club. I gotta get some waters, some food and shit. But we don't really primarily shop at Sam's Club, but we do like for the most part buy like the things that we like in bulk from Sam's Club. So I might show you how I shop my cart. I gotta go to Coles to drop this pen off. I need to find a box for this damn suitcase. I need to go to fucking I just gotta do a lot of shit today. So Peace. Okay, y'all, so I didn't really show y'all the shopping cart per se, but this is the shit that I bought from Sam's Club. Just some water, some detergent, some bacon, some breakfast stuff, got some chicken, some bagels. Uh, just real basic shit that we just needed. Um, also got some snow crab legs here and some other shit I went for to Walmart and picked up some shit up. But yeah, y'all, um, I returned the like Apple Like I was pen. saying, I returned the Apple Pen um, to Kohl's, got that. I'm just gonna wait for the refund so I can get my wife the correct pen for her iPad. And that's basically it, y'all. Um, I think I'll be doing a job today, actually, like a two hour job. So I'm just gonna go start start, start cutting away at this shit, man. Getting my business popping, man. It, it's gonna look a little crazy right now because I'm just starting, I'm starting over. But in due time, man, I'll be there. Peace and love. Thanks for watching this video. Like this video if you like this video. Comment down below and subscribe if you have not already. It's the King J back with another one. Peace.